before we head on out and head south to the... Uh, what was that place again? Olivine City? Let me check the map. Wait, what's this? Hmm, one of the legendary Pokemon appeared on my map. No, make that two! Two of the legendary Pokemon have appeared on my map. My guess is that I do not want to face these guys right now. Maybe later on when my team is ready to fight them. No, that's not it. There we go, Olivine City. That's where I need to go to next. So, uh, yeah, the Pierce, the legendary Pokemon, two or three of them are going to be blocking two of my paths. So even if I wanted to change course and go to another city instead, I can't quite do that. But thankfully, a shortcut back to uh, Violet City is available for me to access at any time. But, uh, yeah. Don't need to worry about that right now. Worry about that when we get to it. I'm so tempted to save, but I can't do that. I want to make sure the recording goes smoothly before I actually do so. Let's uh, go ahead and rearrange the party real fast. There we go. Alright, let's go. What do you have to say? Where did you say you're from? New Barktown? Yes, I did come from quite a long way in order to get here. Alright, Route 38. South to Olivine City. Looks like there's going to be quite a bit of exploring today. Fun times. Oh, really now? Really? Okay, Sailor Harry has only one Pokemon, and it is a Wooper. Bailey scores a one-hit KO. Way to go, buddy. Way to freaking go. And way to score a level up. Oh, wants to learn to move natural gift. What is this? Let's see. User draws power to attack by using a tell berry. The berry determines its type and power. Eh, doesn't sound very useful to me. And uh, yes. Yes, it is quite a world class. Oh. Hello. Alright, thanks. I'll be sure to pick it up when I reach the next town. But first, more exploring, because exploring is fun and I want fun. Sure, I'd be more than happy to teach you a few things. Alright, Donna has two Pokemon, or, and her first one is a Flare... Flaffy. Or is it a Flaffy? Whatever. It has two A's, so it must be Flayfy. I'm going to guess Flayfy is the evolved form of that other sheep-like Pokemon whose name I can't remember for the life of me. But, uh, yeah. Electric-type Pokemon, it exists, it's a thing, and it's going to be super annoying. Reason? Because, well, it knows Thunder Moves. And it is TNT. Dynamite! Even though I just murdered its freaking face. Okay, next up is Psyduck. Wow. Murder much? 
and I just realized I forgot to switch out. Let's... Whatever. Mal is one anyway. Sure, okay. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Not at all. Let me guess, same thing? Yes, that's the same exact conversation we had just two minutes ago! Seriously, what the F? I mean, I get it, I, I know you dropped something off, but still, that's... You don't need to continuously tell me that, hey, I dropped something off for you, blah blah blah. I get it, I'll pick it up eventually. Let me try something I learned today. Okay, what is it? Can you show me? Before I murder your face? Chad's only got one Pokemon, and it is a Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime, I really don't know much of anything about it whatsoever, so go me! Meditate. Okay. Okay, that didn't do very much. Here, try a faint attack. Oh, it used Minic. Okay. <laughs> oh! Nice! Somehow, that uh, move I just executed, super effective against Mr. Mine. I could have swore it's classified as a normal type. And then again, maybe classified as psychic. Yeah, sure, let's exchange numbers. Yeah, whatever. Okay, note to self, she's not going to shut up until I pick up the item. <laughs> uh, this is going to be quite an annoying affair, because every time I'm finishing a battle, she's going to call me and say, Hey, I dropped something off for you. Uh, whoa! Hi there! It's Eradicate! So Eradicate is the evolved form of uh, Rattata. That's it, Rattata. Ow! Okay, never mind, I didn't do very much. Here. Oh wow. Just nearly murdered its face. And you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and catch it. I wonder if this'll work. Ah! Not quite. Okay, any... no. Okay, I can't inflict any sort of status ailments at the moment. Alright, let's try this again. One more time. There we go, it actually worked! Whew. Two tries, but whatever. Deed is done. Another Pokemon added to the collection. And that would be a no. Okay. So yeah, we finally caught enough Pokemon to fill up the first box. Box number two is... It's now live. And thankfully... Pokemon are automatically transferred there, so I don't have to switch to it manually. But anyways, this trainer has only two Pokemon, and our first is... Hop. And it's dead. Bye bye Don't F with pseudo -Wodo. Don't do it. Okay, next Pokemon is a Skip Bloom. What is it? Okay, I'm going to guess, and I'm going to throw my money on the table by saying it's the evolved form of Hoppet. It has a flower on its head. Oh, that was painful. Here, have a rock. Oh, yeah. Way to go to town. 
523, and that's the end of you. So am I. I'm glad to see yours, too. Okay, I'm not gonna answer that, because shut up. Train your tips. Pokemon is starting to evolve, you can stop it. That startled... The startled the Pokemon and stops its evolution. I kind of figured that out on my own, but, uh... Hell, I've actually been told that several times. I wonder what else is on Route 38 before I go anywhere else. Thought so. Hmm. Max Potion. I'm going to bet 20 bucks that this thing heals all HP. Let's take a look. Yep, that's a yes. So that's nice. At least I have that up my arsenal at any time if I need it in the case of an emergency. Next trainer. Fly high into the sky, my beloved bird Pokemon. Oh, hi. Hmm. Bird Keeper Toby. Hmm. What else is new? And his first Pokemon of choice is a Dote Duo. Basically, it's a two-headed ostrich-like Pokemon. And because it's a bird-type Pokemon, it's highly susceptible to rock-type moves. I wonder if it's classified as another type as well. I don't think it is. At least in this generation. Okay, 328 and level 26. Sweet. Hmm, not too bad of a level up. Next up is another Doduo. Seriously? And I just rocked Dote Duo's world. We... We, uh... I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Third Pokemon is another Dote Duo. To tell the truth, I was kind of hoping there would be a Dote Trio, which is the evolved form... Which is the evolved form of Dote Duo. And that thing is even nastier. But hey, it's a thing. And it's down. Down and out. I almost said dead. But whatever. Yay! Anything else over here? Apricorn tree. Nice. White apricorn. Another one for the collection. Oh, hey, a meowth. Sweet. I'm going to catch you. Alright, try to heal wall. There we go. Car sells a meow. Honestly, that wasn't too bad. Loves anything that shines, especially adores coins that picks up and secretly hoards. Huh. Is that so? Well, whatever. That's me out for ya. Oh, hello! Magnemite! Might as well use these while I have them. Or it's not gonna work. Okay, let's try something else. How about a great ball? There we go, call ourselves a Magnemite. Wow, two for two. That is excellent. So it's an electric and steel type Pokemon. Hmm, really? Oops, I did not mean to give it a nickname. 
Ah, damn it. Whatever. I'm just gonna give it its default name then. Okay, there we go. Huh. <sighs> well, I didn't mean to waste all your time with that. But hey, at least I gave it its default name. That's a nickname. Whatever, time to heal, BRB. I'm gonna go ahead and return here instead of back where I was. Reason is because I completely forgot about this tower right here. This is the barrier station to Bell Tower. I completely forgot about this place. Now that I have the newest gym badge, I should be able to... The badge alone will not do any good, but I can let you through. Um, what do you mean? You know what? I'll save this place for later. This may be a place that I'll have to take on in the end game. And yeah, I'm gonna heed that guy's advice. The badge alone may not be of any use because there may be super powerful Pokemon waiting to murder my face. Just saying. <clears throat> Well, uh, anyways, at least we're heading towards our objective, so that's nice. Objective-based play. Me no speak English. Hmm. Hello, it's you. Um, Balba? Yes, it is. You used to run the safari zone in Fuchsia City. Oh, is that so? Oh. <clears throat> sure, I'll register. Okay. Hmm, so the newest safari zone within this region should be open up soon enough. My guess is it'll open up as soon as I acquire the fifth gym badge. Speaking of gym badges, it, since we've acquired the, uh, oh, yeah. since we acquired the latest gym badge or the fourth one rather, hmm, Moo Moo Farm. Why does this place sound familiar? <laughs> Cute. I could have sworn there's a place exactly like this. Oh, Drain Punch. <clears throat> so, uh, let's see. What does Drain Punch do? And what kind of power does it hold? Let's see. Drain Punch. Power 60. Only 5 PP. Energy Draining Punch. User HP is restored by half the damage taken by the target. Not a bad move. Not a bad move at all. I'll have to teach it to someone sometime. But first, let's check out the farm. Hey, yo. Oh. A lot of orange berries. Aww. Let's see, how many orange berries do I even have? Orange berry. I only have three of them. Wow, that sucks. How many do you need exactly? I am not sure. Hopefully we can uh, get enough orange berries to hopefully get the mill tank back up on its feet. Looks like that'll be a side thing that we'll have to do eventually. What is it? Oh shoot, I forgot about stopping at the Pokemart. Dang it. Whatever. Oh. 
wow. That's definitely not good. Definitely gonna have to do something about that eventually. You there, what do you have? What do you wanna do? Alrighty then. Let's do it! Let's fight! Nelson has two Pokemon, and his first Pokemon of choice is a Slowpoke. And it's down and out. That was fast. Well, duly, I'm using a Dark type move. Next up is another Slowpoke. What else is new? There you go. Well, whatever. Slowpoke is down. Yes, they do. Yes, they do.